Irregular migration culture is a serious endeavor that over the years has led to the deaths of many Nigerians and fellow backway migrants in the Sahara Desert. The massive transnational migration of Nigerians to other parts of the world, especially Europe, through illegal routes, porous land borders, the Sahara and across the Mediterranean Sea into Europe has over the years led to economic exploitation. The Belgian embassy at this press conference said that Nigerian girls have been victims of prostitution. About 300 Nigerians are currently seeking asylum. Please notify by, by the visual media, by the written media, by the social media. Please notify, and I think that the Nigerian government hopes the same thing. Notify the youth that it's not a, a, the dream to go to Europe, to go to Belgium. It's not realistic and it's very dangerous. Meanwhile, the DG officers for foreigners said that a 15-year jail term has been placed as penalties for those involved in human trafficking. Penalties always, uh, the last years are going up. Now you can be condemned until 15 years of imprisonment. Uh, 15, one five. Uh, if of course 15, it, it begins with five and then it goes up to 10. And now the, the maximum pen penalty, if, if somebody is not dying, if somebody is dying, it's bigger because at that moment you are responsible for the, the loss of a life. But if somebody is not dying, if it's, it's only exploitation and human trafficking, it's up to 15 years. The mass irregular migration of Nigerian youths to Europe once again re-echoes the call for federal government to alleviate the economic pains by creating an enabling environment for youth to explore their potential here in Nigeria. John Tena, ITV News.